2007 Honda Civic. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to replace your alternator, which is right here. Uh, first step is you're going to disconnect your battery terminals. Then you're going to move on to here. Go ahead and disconnect that piece. Just pry it up and then pull up. And then you have a 10 millimeter nut right here. Go ahead and take that off. And then you have a wiring connector right here. Press on that tab and then pull it up. And then this is your AC compressor wiring. Uh, just pull this up and then disconnect it like that. And then you're gonna remove the belt. So the belt is a 19 millimeter. Uh, this is your belt tensioner right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. Anyway, uh, I have a special tool to use it. You see, it's uh, a little skinnier than a regular ratchet, so I can fit it right here. Put it right here, and then you push up, pull it all the way up to relieve the tension, and then you can slide the belt off. All right, guys, so to remove the belt, there's the belt tensioner right here. Okay, this is a 19 millimeter. Uh, you can either get you one of these. This is a serpentine belt uh, tool. As you can see, it's skinny for tight places like this. If you don't have one of these, just use a 19 millimeter wrench. Place it right there. Place it like that. And then you can use a socket and an extension to get good leverage so we're gonna go ahead and remove this and we're gonna push up like that that's how we relieve the tension in the belt and then we can go ahead and remove the belt push it back down Get the belt out of the way and then we're gonna go ahead and disconnect the uh, alternator first go ahead and pry this out <clears throat> then we will have a connector right here disconnect that one then we're gonna go ahead and pry this up it's a 10 millimeter go ahead and take this off I guess this is a good video to show how to remove your alternator too. So I'll probably put in the title how to remove alternator on these cars also. Take that off. And then we have one more connector right here. See that tab go ahead and push that down and then wiggle up like that and push the connector out of the way now we're gonna go ahead and remove the alternator I believe we have two bolts we have one right here and then if you look down here I don't know if you guys can see it uh, let me let's go ahead and remove the top one first okay so we got two bolts off this is a 12 millimeter yeah so you want to use a long extension with your ratchet uh, that's a 12 millimeter bolt and then if you go down here it's kind of hard to see it you have another one right here which is a 12 okay that's out i'm gonna pull the top one off so the top one is the longest one longer one so we're gonna wiggle it back and forth <clears throat> actually before we do that um we're gonna have to disconnect this wiring right here so it's connected all the way down so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna pry this off and if you break it that's fine
go ahead and disconnect this too. You just push in that tab and it'll pull out. Like I said, uh, this is the same way to replace the alternator. But I'm actually making a video about the AC compressor, but we gotta remove the alternator. So I guess I'll make a video on this one too. If it's not coming off, get you something to pry it off with. Here goes the alternator. Uh, so when you have the new alternator, Put the alternator reverse order uh, make sure you look up a belt diagram so you don't make sure you put your belt routing the right way and then put your battery back on and that's it um, <clears throat> like i said i'm making a video about the ac compressor which is what i'm doing right now but this is the same way to remove the alternator but yeah if you got any questions comment below guys uh, please click on the subscribe button and again, thanks for watching.